So we're going to go through a subcut injection for the OSCE and um, this patient's going to be given insulin and I'm going to go through the steps now on um, demonstrate how to give it uh, OSCE style. So safe to approach, there's no uh, wires or obstacles or liquids on the floor. We're going to do the seven steps of hand hygiene, hand to palm, the hands, is interlaced, back of the fingers, fingertips to palms, thumbs, wrists, 30 seconds to dry. So I'll go and introduce myself. Hello, my name's Helen. I've come here today, I'm a staff nurse, I've come here today to give you your injection of insulin. Um, so is that is that something you knew I was coming to do? Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, Emma. Um, is, what name would you actually like me to call you by? You can call me Emma. Oh, great. Thank you. So, Emma, um, if I just do a full ID check and then I'll explain everything, if that's okay. That's fine. Can I get your first name and your last name, please? It's Emma Hargreaves. And what's your date, uh, date of birth? It's the 26th of October, 1963. Okay, and what's your address? Two Long Street. Northampton. That's correct. I've got that here. You've not got any allergies? No. And that's it. Okay. So, um, yes, it is actually insulin that I've come to give you. And just just to double check, you've not got any allergies to latex? No, I don't. And you don't have any pain or discomfort? Not either. at the moment. So just to explain the drug that I'm going to give you today, it's an insulin, so it's a long acting insulin, it's called Glargine and um, it goes under your skin, uh -huh. uh, we usually give it in the abdomen okay. because it's actually less painful and it's a better place to give um, the subcut generally. Um, so I just need to know whether you've actually had any breakfast this morning? Yes, I did. Yeah, so because this drug it acts on your uh, sugars in your bloodstream, so it um, acts like insulin, so it can transport the carbohydrates and release it to the organs and give you more energy. Okay. Um, so the side effects, so that's the, that's the therapeutic effect, the side effects could be a low blood sugar, so you could actually feel a bit shaky, sweaty, you could feel nauseous. Um, if, you, if you were very unwell, you could feel confused and start feeling drowsy and vomiting. Um, in that case, you would go to hospital. With the milder symptoms, you would have to check your blood sugar. Uh -huh. um, if it's low, so uh, if the sugars are below uh, four and they're going, you need to recheck them. And if your blood sugar, after having some sugary drink or something to eat that's sugary, are not coming back up, you have to go to hospital. Okay? Okay. But um, otherwise, you just have a sugary drink, check it again in 15 minutes, and check it um, more regularly throughout the day. Um, so, could I ask if you've taken your blood sugar today? Yes, I have done it already. Do you know what it is? It was 10.1. Great, that's that's fine. Um, uh, where do where do you keep your insulin? It's in the cupboard over there. Okay, right. So I'm gonna go and prepare my stuff if you're happy, um, and I'll come back and I'll check your stomach and we'll give you the injection then. Do you need to go to the toilet or anything? No, I'm fine. Right. Uh, so I'll go off and get my stuff ready and be back in a little bit. Okay. So dry my hands because I've left the patient. And she's got her insulin here. And I'm just going to check my prescription first. It's all correct. And do the rights of medication administration. So I've just done an ID check, Emma Hargreaves. And um, so it's the right patient. And I've got the right drug, Glargine, which is Glargine here. And she wants 17 units and it's subcut and it's given daily after breakfast uh, and it is signed by a doctor and it says um, to be given today um, uh, at this time. So I'm quite happy that this 
prescription is right, correct and legal. And I've got the right drug and I'll just check that now. So it's Glargenine, 100 units and it expires 2021. So that's all okay. I will don some gloves and an apron just to prepare it. I'm going to use this tray. I'll assume it's been washed with soap and water in the last 24 hours and I will give it a clean with the 70% alcohol wipes. <coughs> I can get my apron. So 17 units, the insulin syringes come in one mil for um, 100 units, so we've got 100 units, so we want 17, so it's a very small amount and I'm going to get that drug ready to, um, get to draw up. So.